Hey Luke, it's me again, my computer, and um, my radio, as you can tell. So, um, I'm not quite sure what's going on here, because, um, I have this cable, and I'll show you the original listing. So yeah, go into my eBay. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I gotta hold this up, please. Sorry, I'm trying to see through the screen. Um. Dotsky. See, so did get relisted. Okay, DK Kong. D E. Oh. Huh. See? The exact same one as shown. Programming cable for Motorola XCS3000, XCS3500, HT1000, JT1000, PP900, MTS2000. And, um. Yeah, I mean, this guy's a good seller. Mm-hmm. Um Com port programming cable from Motorola. And as you can see it's all that basically. Features connector DB9 female BNN BDN six six seven six type soft heavy duty cable processing packaging programming. Um so yeah, the cable, and then I bought this because that's the cable, and that connects fine, and see it's got this, maybe the pins were wrong, or what, and then I got this in, and then it's just got this USB, oh yeah, it's just got a USB to USB adapter. See, so, and then this was the original listing. Click on it. Thank you for being so patient with me. See, and that's what it came with. And I mean, this is fine. It came with a CD. Then this is my CPS. I mean, that came up, and that's good. Then on my upstairs computer, it would, um, whenever I would click on it, it would say, um, this file does not exist. But this time, it doesn't have the tuner. Well, I can download the tuner, but I don't know what it is. And see, when I, um, see, it'll say this. I know that my radio's not plugged in, but here, give me a second, I'll plug it in. I'll, um, have you face this way. Um. Yeah, hold on really quick. I'm so sorry for this. So, I'm at times, bad video quality. But I'm using my iPod again. Because I am. And I've tried every different USB port I have. As you can tell, I mean, I've tried. It says COM port 1, so if you can see in there. One there, one there. Then there's like 15 on the back, and I tried almost all of them. So, um, let me turn off the radio. Um, let's see if I can do this single-handedly. And this wasn't used. I mean, this was a brand new... Hold on. This was a brand new, like I said, brand new programming cable. As you can tell, I turn it on. That's that. Now it's on. When I hit read radio. Read radio. Device communication failed. Now this is the first USB port on my computer. So when I hit read device again. Oh boy, they made that. Com port one. It's the only one. Hit okay. 
that happens. And I don't get it. A little five minute video. I honestly don't get it. And this see this is my CPS. I don't know one. Um right here. It says Motorola XTS three thousand and XTS three thousand CPS version R O five point oh three point oh oh copyright and all that. Is that bad? Because this is version um Service mode R07. Is that the difference? Because if it is, I'm going to be really kind of mad. And then this was where I got it from. I don't want to make this too, too long, but I like it long. I like to watch a video or two. Um, hold on, a little battery. Let me just go into my email because I sent it to myself. Um, let's type in CPS. This was his link, rapidshare.com. Cause I never, I don't know how to get it, but if you can make a copy, see, R05.5 zip. I'm not gonna download it cause it takes an hour. No, it doesn't. It's, let's see if I hit download. I've already done it, but let's sample it for you. Um, cancel. View downloads. See, and I'm not sure what the heck's going on. So if you could get me a message, that would be awesome. And one more thing, what about FPP? Because what's the point in having the keyboard on the XTS 3000 if it doesn't have FPP? That's kind of a nice thing about it, you know? Because I know I don't want 9600 VOD, like you said, that's silly. But I thought any radio that isn't trunked can have, um... Uh, FPP. I mean, I've seen 3000s do FPP. I thought yours did. Because, you know, I mean, I've seen all your videos, and your 3000, you know, I mean, you go to the keypad a lot. You know, and I thought it was FPP. Because on one of your videos, let me find which one it was. Um, Gotta make this under seven minutes long. Let's just look up Luke. I'm so sorry for these long videos. It happens, it's just like Snarling Babadog. <laughs> you know how he makes the long, ranty videos. No offense, because I love them. I love just listening to them. It was, um, let's see. In Sydney, I got a new radio vest. Hey guys, how you going? Let's see what this it is. Velcro, so it's adjustable, so you can adjust it to other radios. And it's got this loop. One thing I reckon would be good is I can put it on my back. <laughs> important thing right now is how important FPP is right now for me. I mean, right here, here. Right here. Um, other than it's chest free. Anyway, um, I'm looking at making a few videos in the future, guys. In the future, guys, uh, I'll, I'll do one important thing right now is how important FPP is right now for me. I'm in Sydney. I don't live in Sydney, so my radio is not programmed for Sydney. It's getting programmed side by side. As I come across them, but say I go to a site out in, say I go to a site outside of Sydney, uh, I would like to listen to the site because I'm there for a few hours and I'm bored out of my mind. With FPP, I just program the site straight in, listen to specific talk groups with specific, you know, where they find their naps. Yeah, so FPP. that's that. Like sitting there going through every nap possible for the site. Alright, so, um, alright guys, I can modify it, or it's me. I do Spock, so as you know. Look at that handsome devil! <laughs> okay, thank you. Bye.